So here's a question that popped up for me on day two of my five day fast. And I might even go longer than five days, but the big question is what does starving really mean? I heard somebody say that they were starving today. And the first thing that came in my mind was they probably ate like maybe four to six hours ago, at most maybe 12 hours ago, or maybe they're an intermittent faster and they ate maybe 16 hours ago. But since this is day two of my fast, it started to make me wonder because throughout the day I felt hungry, but I felt as hungry as I was yesterday. There was no sort of extreme hunger or extreme level of starvation that someone who's truly, truly hasn't had food for a while and is malnourished, it's not that type of experience. And it made me wonder about this idea of how we use words such as starving or hungry. And of course, you know, I, I get it. In general, people use the word starving like, oh, I haven't eaten in a couple hours, I'm hungry, or whatever, or I'm very hungry. But in thinking about what it means for some people who have truly experienced starvation or a lack of food or malnourishment, it really made me stop to think about the my personal lack of understanding of what the meaning of starving means. Because even just through the few times that I've done fasting, I've felt hungry, I've felt a need for food, I've had like a, a just a driving singular focus on wanting food but I can't say I've truly ever felt like I was starving like my body was absolutely dying unless I was able to get food so that was the thought that came to mind that really made me think of who truly knows what the word starving means and have I ever truly experienced it and if I haven't experienced what the word starving means or whether I'm even using it right, you know, am I taking that idea for granted when I have access to plenty of food, but there's plenty of people in other countries that may truly experience starving at a, a very significant level. So that's just something that came to mind. Maybe it's, uh, it's, it's helpful to think about these words that we use or these choices of ways to explain our situations. We all know that words have power. How we describe our life, how we describe our situation has power. Like if you say, oh, I'm incredibly pissed off, that has a different meaning than in saying, oh, I'm just kind of annoyed or uh, that was just like a nuisance, right? Those three ways of explaining our situation have a very different effect on us. So if we are to say things like I'm starving or I'm hungry, I'm famished, that can affect our our thought process and our mental perception of how we feel about our need for food in that situation. Now, I'm not saying never to use the word starving if you haven't eaten in six hours again or whatever. I'm not saying that we should not use that word. I'm just saying to really think about some of the choices of words that we use and whether we truly understand how it feels. And with that said, this is just getting a little philosophical in terms of word choice, but definitely a thought that came to mind while I'm on this two five five plus day fast and it was just interesting but overall pretty exhausted feeling extra exhausted today than usual and with that uh, thank you for watching this video happy to share this experience with you and have a wonderful day